looking like on the edge. We have a little crack. <laughs> <laughs> It's white. Oh, it's purple. It's purple. Wow. Oh, just wait. Oh, my God. That's so cool. It cracked the pot. It laid its egg. I'll see if I get one. It's so cool. It's kind of. Oh, my God. Had it all. That was really very it's like a sparkler. It's so bright. I'm not sure I can handle it yet. It's actually way too hot. Uh, the reaction is in excess of 1600 degrees Celsius. And we know that because the melting point of iron is 1500, what do I have? 1538 degrees Celsius. So it's really, really hot. Now I think it's cool. That's the iron. Yes, you can use the melting component as addition to the sparkler. Yeah, Give me some space. So if I drop this, it's melting through the linoleum. <laughs> Interesting things about very, very hot objects like these. Uh, Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> when something is this hot, you can feel the radiation coming off of it. Don't get too close. It's okay. You'll feel it. Oh. No. Oh, yeah, it's hot. It's very, very hot. That's kind of like cool, it's like a volcanic eruption. Right? Like we made a little island right there. Yeah. So what happened if you like, would it melt something if you like put it on top of it, just like well, a solid object? Let me show you actually what the morning's demo looked like from the morning class. Uh, because we actually we made some glass. We made some glass right here. There's actually a protective coating around the iron that's glass. It's not pretty glass, but it's still, it's like obsidian like glass. It's kind of blackish. Um, yeah, I cracked the other one open, and inside is your little iron egg. I'm going to show you what that looks like. In fact, let's, let's Wait, go back over Why there. isn't it burning the pinchy things then? Well, it's not melting it because this is a tempered steel, so it has a, it has a higher melting point than that. And okay. also, it's cooler already. Right? You saw how white hot it was before? Uh -huh. And you saw we got that little bubble, but even that bubble didn't drip, right? It wasn't that hot that it could flow very well. Yeah. It's kind of like magma, though, except not molten rock, molten iron. Cool stuff. Yes, yeah, so we'll crack we'll crack this egg open tomorrow, and you guys can see what it looks like. I'll show you the morning, uh, the, the one from this morning. And yeah, it does crack the flower pot every single time. <laughs> Materials can't handle really rapid delta T's without kind of some thermal instability. 